Happy New Year from Wally Life. And what better way to jump into the new year than the Paw Pack Polar Plunge. And our friend Matt was on hand to tell us all about it. You got something to tell us, don't you? Absolutely. We're, uh, I'd like to say welcome to the Paw Pack Polar Plunge, our 2023 New Year's Day edition. Here we are. Very cool. So how many people do we have loaded up in here this So today? we have 190 pre-registered. We're expecting to be somewhere around 225 or so by the end of the day. That's almost so double last time. It is. We ended up about 75 or 80 last year, so we're quite happy. Woohoo! All right, 2023, the place to be, the Paw Pack Polar Plunge. Yeah! The Paul Pack Polar Plunge at First Class Marina brings out people of all ages and a host of characters, all in support of the Ledgedale and Tafton dive teams. Hi. Polar Plunge. Many people participate to tick one of those boxes off of their bucket list, and others come out just to play dress up. The safeties for the day prep the area to make sure there are no ice chunks and that no one slips as they enter the water. A countdown was made for each of the scheduled slots as people took the plunge for this amazing cause. Good to see you. Yeah. So we're hanging out with Michelle here. Yay. Yay. And this is your what? How many times have you done this? A lot. Uh, seventh, I think. Yes. Seven. Yeah. So seventh Paw Pack Polar Plunge. And I will tell you, it is a joy to see you every oh, year come awesome. out. It's awesome. It's awesome to be here. So how's, how's life? What's going on? Like, well, you're back? So I'm back. I'm still working. Uh, nursing. Nursing is as, as busy as ever. Shout out to all the nurses. Woo Thank you. Yay. Um, this year, though, I will be 50 years old. So I'm hitting it big. This is the beginning of my 50. My all big right. 50. I actually got my children to sign up for it. So my children will be here in another, yeah, about a half hour. Yeah. They're going to get it. I get to do it with so my the daughter. Family Michelle special. is here yeah. in full effect. We cannot wait. We want to oh. see them. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait. That's um, awesome. Yeah, so it's great to be here. Awesome. Yes! Rock, doesn't she? Yeah, yes. she rocks. Yes. Mama's awesome. So seven times in, this is her 5-0 wish list, and you just made it happen. Yeah, that's cool. It's all about family, fun, and freezing here at the Paul Pack Polar Plunge. So, like I said, family, fun, friends, and freezing cold water 
is a great mix to start out the new year for this amazing charity fundraiser. An awesome way to spend New Year's Day. Talk to me about what this event means for you guys as far as funds go or just things. What, what, what goes on once this event's over with you guys? Well, the event is one of our main uh, events to you know raise funds for any dive gear, you know, our dive suits, our uh, tanks, our weights. There's a, a whole bunch of stuff that we get from this. Um, I mean, everything from throw bags to, you know, there's like tons of stuff, life jackets. Um, but, you know, mostly the dive equipment, that's the really expensive part. So that helps out a lot. And, uh, you know, we can't thank people enough for coming out and actually participating. I mean, it's great. Great turnout today. So now you know, these guys go out here, they dive in the water to save, to rescue, to find things, to pick, find gear. Mm -hmm. ATVs have been pulled out of, yep. the, out of the lake and people have been pulled out of the lake. So we want to yep. thank you guys big time yep. and this event is also amazing to help them further their efforts to keep the area safe we're able to get the gear that we can you know go out save lives um, recover you know ATVs or uh, jet skis that get swamped anything like that uh, sometimes even boats so there's there's a lot of things that we do with the funds that are raised here and it's one of our main events that we that we have for getting funds for some, this event is as fun as Halloween, as these Santas continue the spirit of giving. And for others, it's another way to celebrate with family, including the fairy kind. Families, large and small, from all walks of life and geographic locations, come out to get wet and give back. So, we've got father, son, we have Alex. we've got grandkids that came, and Alex, cool, grandkids that came up from, oh well, well where'd you guys come from? Tennessee. Way cool. All right, so talk to us. This was on your what? Bucket list. Yes. Yeah. And now you've done it. Yes. Would you do it again with these guys? Absolutely. Yes. <laughs> it's for a great cause. So where'd you come from? That's cold, Florida. It was colder there than it was up here. Wow. You, my sir, come on over here. Because you came from where? Hawaii. Wow. <laughs> so what are you doing in Hawaii? I'm in the Army. So. Was this as bad as boot camp? <laughs> he had to think about it. Did you go in as well? Yeah. Oh. To here. So how do you feel? <laughs> so you guys came all the way from North Pocono? Yeah. That's awesome. So what, does, what, why, why would you come out and do this? It's freezing. Uh, we thought it would be fun. Yeah. Yes, and it was. Yeah. Kind of. Well, it kind of. So you came out today, you thought it was going to be fun, but really tell me, like, what was your experience like? Cold. Um, <laughs> I thought um, that I wouldn't feel my feet again. <laughs> you feel like you're never going to feel your toes again? <laughs> no. <laughs> I love it. College boys coming back to support the area. So, yes, talk sir. to me. What are you doing? Uh, we're going to go in some cold water uh, and hopefully enjoy it. Hopefully enjoy it. And yourself? That's exactly how I feel right now. Hopefully I'll enjoy it. The anticipation of the freezing cold. There are chunks of ice in there, guys. You ready for it? Gotta no. Be. Gotta <laughs> <be>. <laughs> Not ready for it at all. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Alright. 
Amazing! I'm so cold! Yes! And you said it was a great start to what? The new year. Yeah! And yourself, bud, what's yeah. up? No way better to start it. No yeah. way better no way to better. start the new year no than better. to come out and support the Pop Hat Polar Blonde! <laughs> so you said this wasn't on your bucket list? No, he just said he was jumping in a creek, so I, or the lake, and I'm like, I always wondered why people would do that. And here I am. <laughs> <They're crazy. laughs> yeah! Because we're all crazy. <laughs> awesome. I'll do it next yeah. year. Come on back down! <laughs> Yeah, to tomorrow. get part of my family to Okay. Come. How was it? It was cold, but it was worth it. We had a yeah. great time. That's Real, awesome. Yeah, a lot of fun. How many people you bring out? We have four of us together. Yeah, yeah. So what are your plans for the new year? We're going to go average, just mediocre <laughs> after this. <laughs> so you, you started out on the high, and now you're just going to keep it right. chill for the rest of the year. <laughs> I love it. So talk to us about what this means. So honestly, really, it, it was it was an easy thing to, for us to decide to do this. These guys dive in anytime, anywhere there's somebody in need. And it's really kind of the spirit of Christmas, right? I mean, they give, give, give um, whenever it's needed. And so this is really an easy thing to do to give back to them when they give all the time. So Thank you so yes, much. Thank you. <laughs> all right. Let's give it up. Woo, woo, woo. All right. We hear someone dared someone to go back in. Oh, Talk to me about it. Yes. Absolutely. Tom went in. He only got up to like his, his stomach, right? So a little extra money. Tom gets his head wet. Why not? Got to dive in there. Get a little extra dollars out of people. So, yeah, good good friend of mine, you know, like got a sense of humor a little bit. You know, he's like, kind of do, I'll do $500 donation to the fire department if you get your hair wet. So, so Tom had to, had in, to, had to go back in. and he set down the gauntlet. I had to Take go one apart. for the team. I love it. That's yeah. awesome. Anyway, That's awesome. Thank you, bud. We're here. Definitely like, we'd like to say thank you to First Class Marina. Tom, Tom and his family have really put and, and, a lot yeah, out wife, for us. These and, guys did a lot of work. They did a lot of leg work and the whole dive team, both dive teams put a lot of leg work to make this all happen. And, and everything else. This so we awesome. appreciate these guys because without them, we would the community would suffer. You know, no question about it. So, so you came out to support the dive team. Tell us, tell us about why you think this is important. This is important because we've had a family member who drowned, and to always wear your life jacket and support your local dive team. So a shout out to the dive team, to first class, and to everybody that came out to the Paul Pack Polar Plunge 2023. So if you're looking for something to do, and I mean something fun, all while supporting your local dive team and fire department, then come and raise some funds at the Paw Pack Polar Plunge at First Class Marina. For more information, visit facebook.com slash pawpackpolarplunge. And we can't wait to see what the next plunge brings. So grab those wacky outfits and creative costumes, and we'll see you next year.